going on, guys? I guess I should have put in the uh, in the thumbnail that it was a giveaway because it is, but I didn't want to. I didn't want to publicize it because I only want it to be like the people that are like truly, truly here. You know what I'm saying? What's up, Deranged? What's up, dude? What's up, Andrew? Nothing much, man. Just uh, just thought I'd randomly go on. Shivam, what's up, bro? Hey, Shivam, where are you from, bro? Hydro, what's up, dude? I'm assuming you're you're a man or you're a male, uh, but welcome, bro. You're the more the merrier, dude. JB, what's up, bro? Yes, dude. Absolutely. I was just I was just telling the people that were here uh, before that. I, um, I guess I should have put a. I guess I should have put in the thumbnail that this was a giveaway, but I just wanted to. I didn't want to like you know. I don't know. I wanted to see who would show up. Let's see. Shivam says from Trinidad and Tobago. Let's go. Yeah, no, I know. I know where that is, uh, Shivam, uh, in the Caribbean. How are you guys doing out there? I love that you found the flag immediately. What's going on with you, Andrew? How's your night going, man? Hydro, you are you are more than you are more than welcome, bro. I'm glad that you're here. Uh, if you're here to make friends, Hydro, I'll tell you this much: this this group right here, the people that are going to show up, there's going to probably be like 20 or 30 people that 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 hop in and out, and they're probably some of the well, that, not probably they are the best people that are in this community, dude. All they they're only here to to support people. You see, look, there you go. Derange is already saying. Mr. Castles, what's up, dude? What is up? Corso, what's up? How are you? I can't believe you guys. You guys are so funny. Fook Fook says, just made it. You are, you are, you are just in time, Fook Fook, and I love your name. Gustavo, what's up? How's it going, man? Peace, bro. What, I don't know where, where you are, but uh, cheers from the United States for sure. Derange says, that's why I'm here. Shivam. We're fine, bro. Just on lockdown. Oh, dude. I'm so sorry, man. It's everywhere. So just so you guys know, whether you whether you know or not, I'm in California. So I'm in downtown, you know, uh, like Scaredsville. So everyone, you know, it's locked down here. I mean, you can see I, mean, I had to, I made a, uh, an office in my garage. Will Ball says, keep up the great work. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that. Focus Spot, what's up? Corso, I am I am doing well today, man. Thank you. Hey, no worries, deranged. Uh, take care of the people in the Discord, dude. It's you know, it's it, it's young. It's it's new and it's young. Jr. I 100% shout out to you, bro. I hope you're having an amazing day. Uh, JB says, love your vid from earlier today. Me and my boys are having much better pulls from Shining Fates, yeah, and battle styles and cha or Champions Path. So that's what we're going to do today, guys, is we're going to talk about some stuff. And then I think we should, like, bust into an ETB of, of uh, Champion's Path. Why not? Champion's Path has been kicking my butt lately, so I figured give it a, give it a chance with all you guys. Oh, there, there's, there's, there's Ryan, a.k.a. Tony. What's up, bro? So, so you guys know from last time, uh, Ryan Ridge is the, uh, is the mod for – for right now for for my for my youtube and my lives and stuff like that so uh you know he's the he's the dude and then deranged slime is uh is one of my mods for the for our discord and in case you didn't know our discord is the poke of all uh if you're into that sort of thing and it's just everyone that's here um and you know they just poured it over there let me see i, I kind of got behind here mr castle my wife and daughter are watching right now mr castles and fam uh, thank you for being here. I appreciate you guys. You guys are amazing. Gustavo, Puerto Rico. I uh, hope you guys are doing uh, doing okay out there. Uh, Hydro Hydro wants to know if anyone's from Asia. I not. I don't know. Mit, possibly. 
Matt, Matt Van says, bust it. Yeah, we're going to. Andrew Flint says, good job, Ryan. Yeah. Uh, it's funny to call you Ryan. His, Ryan's actual name is Tony, and I don't know if he, if he wants that to be known, but I already said it, so 20 people know that, Tony. <laughs> Hydro says, because I'm an Asian. <laughs> Dude, well, oh, man, that, you're funny, bro. There's a there's a lot of I don't even know what you'd call it, man. I, every time I turn on the news, it seems like they're they're trying to talk about some kind of Asian hate or someone hating on someone and some racial thing. It's ridiculous. I can't watch the news. It makes me sick. Durain says, "Wow, already twenty people." And I I can't believe it either, man. I, you guys are you guys are freaking crazy. Focus Boss says, "Hey, I just started making videos with my son." And, and my son does all the editing. I was wondering if I can share the video in the chat later, maybe towards the end of the stream. Would that be okay? Of course, dude. Of course. <laughs> Ryan says my alias is blown. Yeah, your your alias is blown for sure. JB says outed. <laughs> Shivam says we're closing in on 3K subs. Yeah, it, this is a it's a weird thing, guys. I'll tell you, I, I've I uh, so I've never. I've, I've been, I was on Instagram for a little bit like years ago and then I got rid of it. Facebook. I was never really like attention seeking in that way. Like I didn't really care about the followers, but now that I watch analytics on the YouTube channel, it's crazy. I, I can't tell you how many people come and go like one day I'll get 30 subs and then I'll lose 10. And then the next day I'll gain 10 and lose none. And then the next day I'll gain, you know, 20 and lose five. It's so weird. Like I personally have never, unsubscribe to a channel that I've subscribed to. So it, it's interesting how that happens. Green says share the video. Um, my country is pretty close to the main to mainland Japan. I've always wanted to go to Japan, Hydro. We have hidden fate TDBs coming coming in the mail tomorrow. Yeah, Spenzel, Spen Sizzle says he's got some ETBs coming. I also have some ETBs coming. I just bought 10 ETBs and I bought 100 packs off of Rusty at TCA. Uh, Durain says I'm never leaving. Don't don't leave, bro. Santiago Santiago's heated up. He's heating up. Uh, Santiago says, "Do you like Chinese cards?" I absolutely like Chinese cards, and I think that they're that they're very slept on. I think ja I think Japanese like car Pokemon cards are slept on still in the states, especially of course. <laughs> Spin Sizzle says, "Okay, flex on me." No way, not even like that. I was just uh, I was. I was uh, with you on that, on the ETBs. I'm getting more ETBs. Durain says, I have 50 packs of battle styles if you want to buy them. I I have a lot of battle styles. I just haven't opened them on the channel yet. Uh, I don't know if the hype's there yet on those. And, uh, yeah, I am uh, I get kind of stuck. I get stuck on uh, on certain sets, you know? I Like, I'm, like right now, I'm obviously on Shining Fates. I, and, and I... In the past, I purchased cards, but like right now, I refuse to purchase this damn card. I want to pull that shot. I want to. I want to. If you know what I'm talking about, I want to feel the feeling of pulling that card. Uh, let's see. Shiva says I was supposed to ask. I saw you started a YouTube channel back in 2010 or something. So, and you recently started posting vids. Was that account or? Yeah, that wasn't me, Shivam. I, I I just created this account. That wasn't that wasn't me. Uh, I had like a little uh, account with my wife like two years ago where we tried to do a, uh, like a vlog podcast type of thing and it didn't work. Uh, Sonia says, have you pulled Tyranitar? Alter no, I haven't pulled. I haven't pulled the, the Tyranitar yet. And Matt says, major love slash hate with battle styles. Yeah, for sure. Fufu says, thanks for selling my brother the PSA base at two Alakazam for such a good price, by the way. I didn't even know that was you or that was your brother. Tell them, tell them, uh, congrats. That's awesome. Yeah. I, um, I, I do have a, uh, uh, an eBay store, uh, and you guys are awesome. Well, I, I don't know. It's hard to match up who is a follower of the channel and who's buying. I just kind of, you know, I just treat it as whatever, you know, if it, if it comes in, it comes in. I try to be as fair as possible. Spence Sizzle says I have, Jap yeah, I have Japanese cards that are extremely, or Japanese cards are extremely slept on mid Neo Genesis Lugia for 300 in Japanese, but it's 2k in English. I'm telling you guys right now. So the, part of this is investing. All right, so let's start talking about that. So 
Big cards in English sets may not be big cards yet in Japanese sets, but I'm telling you, it's a trickle down. So just like first edition base set is out of reach for everyone, including myself. Then it goes to Shadowless. Shadowless is out of reach. Then it's going to go to base set unlimited. So, so it's a trickle down. So if you can't get the Lugia and Neo in English, it's going gonna, it's gonna to trickle down to where the Japanese card starts to elevate in value. So that is something to keep in mind. All right. Um, JB says, I wanted to go after the PSA 7, no symbol Jolteon, and I got hung up at work. Yeah, dude, that thing sold for like 90 bucks. I thought it was a good deal. Uh, San Diego says, did your wife like Pokemon too? She does not. But she likes me, so she lets me do Pokemon. Uh, thoughts on the birthday cake Pikachu? I have a few, Shivam, and I think they're properly priced. I think a mint copy goes for a couple hundred, right? Maybe like a, or No, maybe like a hundred for a mint copy. I think it's properly priced. I think it's right there. PSA 10 in that uh, could be something to go after. All right, let's talk about some stuff before we crack some packs. So you guys ask me all the time, uh, you know, stuff to invest in. And then I get people asking me from all levels, whether it's just a pack all the way up to, you know, I, there's obviously some big players that, that are followers of my channel uh, that can spend a couple grand. Some people have messaged me on that. So I want to I want to key you guys in on something. And I'm I'm telling you, that this is going to be it's not a slept on card per se but the slet the set itself is slept on obviously this is something that i'm giving away for five thousand subs right so you guys if you guys know or you don't know uh hey what's up ben yeah stick around dude so this is the rain this is the rainbow rare charizard from burning shadows okay this comes out of this set okay burning shadows and it comes out of this booster box okay so this card, loose, is a couple hundred bucks. I think it's a good buy. These blisters, a year ago, were $5, if not less. I think they're maybe like, you can find some for eight or nine right now. This is a really good buy right now, guys. Okay? I see the I see this set having a lot of room to grow. Okay? And you can buy, you know, little guys like this. If you want to know where to start collecting and you want to make good investments, uh, go, shoot, shoot, sorry. I just drop this card um start small because these things grow it's you know it's it's just it grows incrementally right uh and and i always I always stick to a rule when it comes to when it comes to yeah andrew i agree uh when it comes to smaller stuff you just you just buy if it's if you don't if you think this could ever be less than five dollars don't buy it this is never going to be less than five dollars. So if you can buy it at five, six, seven, it's a good buy. It's going to go up. Okay. This box right now, Evolutions is obviously the most wanted. You know, Sun and Moon, right? Like, uh, or X. I, I'm sorry, X and Y. Uh, but it, like they, this kind, I think this is like the the Sun and Moon's Evolutions. Okay. This this set has this card. This card is so rare to pull in a PS or to get in a PSA 10 because the 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 print quality was trash. Look at the look at the back of this card, okay? I pulled this card on this channel and it is mint. Like the card itself is mint, but if you look real close, you can see where the where 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 the blade went. If you look on it real close, I can literally see the blade that cut this card. And because I don't know if they didn't sharpen the, the blades or what or what. Brobo, what's up, dude? How's it going? Welcome. Uh, so it's just something to consider. Where, where did I put the – okay. So this card, I'm lucky enough to have it in a PSA 10, and I'm not trying to flex. But if you can pick this card up, if you're a player like that, I'm telling you right now, mark my words, guys, because I'm still going to be in the game in two or three years from now. This is going to be – a ten thousand dollar card i'm telling you right now and i'm going to tell you why this card is going to end up like the evolutions charizard where there's going to be five thousand psa eights and nines and there's going to be a couple hundred psa tens if you can get this card in a psa 10 i would highly highly recommend it okay uh that's my that's my my recommendation this is and then if not if you can chase the card out of the set then do that because this is still a very good deal for the cards that come in here. This is only four hundred bucks right now, uh, and and I and I'm not trying again. I'm not trying to flex and like make it sound like 
someone can't afford that or it's less than or whatever. But if you guys really, really want to know where to start, start here or start here and then get one of these loose if you can for a decent price. This is never going to be a bad a bad call. And some of you guys might be thinking, oh, you know, uh, Pokemon might be going down. Don't. It, 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 may, it may dip in certain areas, but if you ever are nervous about jumping into Pokemon in a certain spot, always lean on this freaking dragon, okay? Get into something that has this dragon because it's going to always hold value, okay? No matter what. No matter what ha no matter what's happening in the world, no matter who's fighting who or who the president is, like whatever the economy is, taxes, blah, 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 this thing is always going to hold value because it's it's embedded in people's hearts uh, for, for generations, okay? So that's one thing. Now, another, another thing that I think is slept on, you've started to see hidden fates kind of kind of go down in, in price a little bit. You might be able to pick one of these up uh, maybe for 40, 45 bucks, right? These have four packs of Hidden Fates in them, and it contains this Charizard, okay? This set contains this Charizard, right? This card, I don't know how much it's going for right now, maybe like in the thousand, like low thousands. This is also, it's not going to be, it's not going to be like this because the print quality on Hidden Fates was a million times better. The print quality on, on Burning Shadows, absolute trash dumpster fire, okay? So this one, there's going to be more of these, but it's 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 a good buy. If you can buy it loose, get it. If you can buy some of these, pick some of these up here and there, these tins are going to be worth a couple hundred bucks in a few years. I'm telling you right now, especially if it's the first print run. Even if it's the, the reprint, it's still going to hold value, but also good buys, guys. And you can see a common theme. It's all, it's all Charizard. It's all Charizard. Not only is he one of my favorites, he's not my favorite Pokemon, but for investing purposes, purposes, I always lean on the lizard. You know what I'm saying? So keep that in mind. Let me let me go back to the chat a little bit. Uh, let's see. Yeah, Mr. Castle. Yeah, th Mr. Castle says thanks for the tip. Uh, Shum says I'm going to start hunting for that card in a ten <laughs> from tonight. Yeah, do it. Uh, yeah, last year's Pokeball, uh, Pokeball tins have one in it. It says Brayden. That's true. Zard, Zard, Force, Touch, any other card, Shivam? What do you mean by that? Uh, Pokemon chasing since 97. Seriously, Mr. Castles. Broba says, I still haven't gotten my first Zard, but I but I finally got my first fun hit. Cool. That's awesome. Fufu says, my next purchase is going to be Hidden Face, Shiny Zard. I'm tell I, I, and I don't want to tell, guys, I don't want to tell you how to, ch how to spend your money, uh, but you guys ask a lot. And I just want you to um, take it into consideration. If you have it, if if you want to jump in somewhere, I'm trying to give you places where you can jump in and out. That's the hardest part. Uh, Durain says, "I really appreciate the 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 tips. No problem." Spence Sizzle says, "That's what I, that's what I'm glad I have two Zards for CPS and B, CP6 and BGS uh, right now." Durain says, "I'm going to buy tin on Friday to keep sealed." Yep. Uh, Andrew says, what about Vivid Voltage? I'm not mad at that at all. I picked up a few booster boxes. Uh, if you want to pick up a booster box, for, I'm, I, I've been saying this for, for a few months now. You can jump in on a booster box of Darkness Ablaze, okay, for 180 bucks right now. I'm telling you guys, this this is going it, to it, – it, obviously, this is the newest set, right? It, it, this is going to continue to raise in value because it has, where is this guy? Maybe they didn't put it on here. This has that Charizard. This has that full art Charizard and it's, there's a chase card in here. Any, any set that has a Charizard chase card, you can jump in on that and you're, and you're not going to be doing poorly. Okay. All right. My last, my last tip, my last bit of advice. Oh, let's see. Hold on. Let me go back to the chat. Tyler says, what is up? Vault mob swag. Yeah. <laughs> There's so many. I think I messed up by by recommend or like asking for names because now everyone's calling the the squad different things. Uh, let's see. Santiago says, I don't know if I should feel bad, but I got a case a a basic Charizard. The kid was 12, and I just gave him both. I mean, you know, what it, what whatever you think, you know, a good deal depending on who you're talking to is really uh, it's perception, right?
It's whatever whatever they perceive as a good deal. Braden says, would you recommend getting a shiny Charizard GX? Oh, would you recommend getting a shiny Char Charizard GX from? Uh, if you're saying to get a shiny Char Charizard GX, then yes, I recommend getting that. Hidden Fates, even if it is not going to get a 10, 100%. Any, anything, anything Charizard where you're buying it for a reasonable price. Uh, Shivam says, where I'm from, when one item is more superior, we say item, okay, greater than other items. Yeah, so, okay, I get you. I get what you're saying now, Shivam. I get what you're saying. Mr. Castle says, I'm lagging. Uh, <laughs> Tony says, Tony says, Vault Gang. Deranged says, Shining Fates, Cham Champion's Path, Burning Shadows, Hidden Fates, Darkness Ablaze. Those are the main five to invest in right now. You're not, you're not wrong. Um, okay. So I'm going to give you guys one hidden gem that I highly, highly suggest if you can grab one to grab one. They go for about 120 to 150 bucks. Okay. So you guys are going to be like, whoa, that was, this was 30 bucks in Target forever. They were. And I wish I would have bought in 100. Okay. These are climbing in price right now because of this guy right here. It has that full art. It's the same full art artwork as the Burning Shadows but it's in promo form. Now, this card is skyrocketing in price for PSA 10. So if you can see that, this card right here, guys, if you can get this card, this card's gonna be a couple thousand dollar card. Easy, easy. So if you guys can pick, so just look at Charizard GX uh, uh, Premium Collector's Box. These things are wicked. It's all Charizard. It's got the pin. It's got a few Burning Shadows, some Guardians Rising. It's got, yeah, two Guardians Rising. And then it's, I think it has, I don't know what that is. I think it may even be, I don't, I don't know what, what packs are behind there. But it comes with six packs. It comes with a full R Charizard, uh, you know, promo card. I'm telling you guys, something to think about. So, Yeah. Yeah, but look at it. I mean, is this like, I just love it. I don't know what it is, but I love this artwork. Check out that artwork. Same artwork in in three different forms. I love it. That's all, That that's the investing tips that I had for you guys, but I'm still staying on. Don't, don't like, don't trip, but um, Super's in the house. What's up, Super? Let's see. Dude, I have a ton of bulk from black and white through X and Y era. And I found two Radiant Collection Zards. Yeah, Spend Sizzle, you should uh, take the best out of there and get it graded. Tyler says, I would say buying Darkness of Blaze and, and Chilling Rain booster boxes are your best buck, your best bang for your buck for for your buy, especially for investing. Derange says, Derange says, yeah, that's gonna it's gonna skyrocket. Mr. Castle, well, it's awesome. Super! I, I read your other comment before that one. Um, Tyler says, is that red and blue edition? Is that the red and blue edition boxes? I think so. I don't know. Is it? It says full R Charizard GX. I don't know where it says red and blue. I don't know. I don't know, but that's the guy you want. I I'm 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 really thinking about like breaking these open just to get those graded again. Let's see. Uh, Matt Matt says, "Got to be a teacher tomorrow." Let's let's bust that chance. All right, all right, all right. Here we go. Just because Matt said, okay. Just because Matt Van Stratton said, let's bust it up. So, okay. On the investing tip, I've talked about this in previous videos. This has a guarantee Charizard in it, guys. Okay. So let's talk about this for a second. So obviously, Champion's Path is is pretty trash, in my opinion. Aside from the rainbow Charizard, the shiny Charizard, and then the Charizard you actually get inside of the ETB. I've opened up so much product today, it's kind of sickening. All right. So, got the packs. So, number one, you're kind of, ooh. Yeah. Okay. So, another example, guys. So, this comes guaranteed, right? How many ETBs do you know that can come that comes with a guaranteed Charizard, right? So this is one 
Uh, I would highly suggest get these are these have already doubled in price within the last month. You could get them for 60, 70 bucks. Now they're 120. So they're on the climb. And these are there's a lot of PSA 10s running around for these. You can get a PSA 10 of this right now for $110. Go buy one, guys. If you have $110 to burn, go buy one of these and you'll thank me in three years when they're worth $600. Okay? Do it now. I'm telling you, I'm telling you guys and girls, I'm telling you, this is a good buy. Okay. All right. So what do we got here? We got 10 packs. Let's bust these open. All right. I'm think I'm going to, all right. Someone give me a number from one to 10. I'm going to give away one of these packs. I'm not even going to open it. Maybe we'll do that for two. So someone give me a number between one and 10 and then we'll do a random giveaway. And I'm going to give two of these away. Okay, number eight. So Shivam says eight. All right, eight and seven. Okay, eight and seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's going to go to somebody. And then, oh no, and then seven. So seven was right behind it. All right, there we go. So let's open some and then I'm going to give those two away. I think we should give this one away. I mean, what do you guys think? Maybe those will be the three giveaways and I'll give away, th this will be the last giveaway. Why not? All right, let me change this up real quick. Oh, there's a commercial, of course. All of them. Jereen says all of them. Let's see if we can pull a, a freaking Charizard here, guys. That would be uh, that would be amazing. So this ETB has been sitting on my desk forever. All right. It's kind of hard to see in reverse. Let's go. Let's get the fire up. Nothing. Nothing home. There's a the code card. 24 people. I'm surprised. You guys are you guys are awesome. All right, here we go. And these these are these gar these guaranteed have a hit in them, just so you know too. It's one of those like special sets. This is what I'm talking about, man. I I'm telling you guys, Champions Path has been so like dookie for me i don't know i don't know what it is maybe it's just like i don't know i just come into it like ne with like negative vibes in my mind and i'm just like it's just not gonna hit i'm gonna stuff all over my desk scrafty pokeball so piper actually loves this set believe it or not she loves the art all the artworks like because there's a lot of girl trainers like this like like marnie there's a lot of girl trainers in there uh that she likes to collect so my daughter, whether you know or not, she's sleeping right now, but she not only sleeves all the cards, she sleeves commons, uncommons, rares, but she also sleeves code cards and energies individually. I've even caught her sleeving sleeves, and I'm not even kidding. Third pack magic? Yeah, I wish. I'm get, I get no pack magic, but look at this. this is what, are you guys seeing what I'm talking about? With Champion's Path, Champion's Path just absolutely wrecks my soul. All right, four packs left. It just absolutely ruins me. It's crazy. All right, let's pull something. Let's go. Pika Piper. Something, right? Is that, a, is that a reverse script? Gosh, dang it. Look at this. Get out of here, Scrafty. No one likes you. Actually, I like Scrafty. He's a funny Pokemon. I, I remember seeing him in the in the show. And he was like a little, like disgruntled little dude. I know, right, dude? Deranged. What is going on? What is going? What is what is going on with the with, with these packs? Well, I'll tell you this much: whichever those packs that I'm giving away, those probably have Charizards in them. And if they do, you have to tell me. Are you freaking? Not even uh, uh not even an EX. Nothing, guys. Oh, man. So, another reason just to keep it sealed. <laughs> Paul says, hey, brother, sorry I'm late to the fun. Uh, is this Shining Fates? No, it's Champion's Path, Paul. More like freaking Loser's Path because I never pull anything in the set. I've never pulled anything, like, incredibly good in the set. Look at this. Are you kidding me? A hollow Senna Scorch. All right, so I'm telling you guys, if these two packs, 
so so just so, you, so I don't know. I know we we we, we uh, a couple of people came in like right after. I'm giving these three things away. I'm giving two packs away in this Charizard. There is something in these packs because I don't know. There's been nothing in these other packs. Maybe we'll let the people decide if they want to open them on the screen, and then I'll send you the contents. That would be cool. Just to, just so we can see. Fook Fook is out of here. Bye, Fook Fook. It's okay, Fook Fook. You're not missing anything because these these, these packs are Fook Fook. There you go. No one likes you, Duraludon. Okay, nobody. I pulled like like ten of those. There you go. All right, let's do this giveaway. Someone's got to get something because I've been getting crapped on by Champions Path for the last as long as it's been out. I've I've opened so much Champions Path, it's insane. I did pull early on. I can't I can't totally lie. I did pull a Rainbow Charizard. Before I even had the channel, I was sitting on my couch with my brother-in-law, and I pulled a Rainbow Charizard. So I can't say nothing, but like that was the one and only hit. All right, if we're getting the pack. <laughs> Shivam says we're getting the pack in pack eight. All right, so I'm just gonna ra I'm just gonna randomly pick a pick a comment, guys, and let's give away this pack right here. Okay, so so throw in something in the comments. I'll give you guys like ten seconds, and then I'm gonna randomly pick a comment. Just throw just whatever you want. It doesn't even have to be anything. All right, here we go. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one, and it it land on deranged slime. That is uh, that is so funny. It, with this comment, it says, "What the heck?" So deranged slime, this is your pack, dude. <laughs> Ryan says, "I won." Oh man, it's so funny. I'm gonna get your guys' comments. Don't worry. All these comments are, are going towards something. Don't worry. <laughs> Nick, Nick put Nick put 57366. Hey, deranged. So let me ask you, and I'm gonna watch for your comment. Do you want this sent to you sealed or do you want it opened? Just let me know that. So I'll wait for your comment. Durange says I'm actually so happy. So let me know, buddy. Do you want this sealed? Or do you want me to open it on the on the on the the stream and then and then I'll send you the contents or I'll send you the clothes pack too? Open it for the squad, he says. Let's go. Dur See, Derange is a, is a team player. You gotta love that. Bobby, what's up, dude? Welcome to the live, bro. What what is up? All right, here we go, Derange. This is this is yours, buddy. Here we go. I'm gonna leave the cards right here. Zigzag Zigzagoon. Is that, I always I always miss the Z in the middle. Volpex, Rock Rough, Reverse Energy. Ah, oh, dude, I'm sorry, man. Yeah, Hatterene, Hollow. Here, and I'll I'll leave you with the code card. All right, bro. And I didn't even know if that's worth sending, to be honest, man. I I I'd rather send you two bucks and and be done with it. All right, next pack. I know, right? It's trying, I'm trying to make it fun. I, if one of you guys hit the Charizard, that would be so wicked. I would be I would be so happy about that. All right, here we go. So throw in some comments. I'll give it like 20 seconds this time because a bunch of comments came. And then this is going to go to one of you guys. JB says, let's go. Andrew Flynn says, Pokeball. Hello, Andrew Flynn. Siddha, what's up? All right, here come the comments. Here come the comments. Shivam says, let's go. All right, here we go, guys. All right, here we go. Just going to go for a random comment. All the comments are coming in. Nick Burr says, give me char char. All right, here we go. Ready? One, two, three. Super. No way. Super. There you go. Last pack magic. That was the comment. Super with last pack magic. So super. She, okay, super is funny. She, she comments first on everything. Uh, or if she's not first, she's second. So super, Pika Piper, <laughs> super. Do you want me to send this to you sealed, or do you want to open it on the stream? I'll let you decide. And don't worry, no one will get mad. And we still have this one to give away, guys. This one, I'm obviously just going to send it to you guys. So, 
I'm gonna wait for your for your comments, Super. Tell me if you want me to open this or do you want me to send it sealed? Oh, Super says open. <laughs> Super says open with three exclamations. So I'm gonna tell you guys something. If there's nothing in here for Super, we did all we got out of this this entire ETB was this guy right here. That will be it. If we don't get anything out of this pack, that's all. And which is actually kind of crap because there should at least be some kind of ratio like hit level, right? All right, here we go, Super. This is all you. Let's go. Something for Super. Something. <sighs> Dude, I'm so sorry, Super. That is, okay, I'm not kidding you guys. That is absolute trash. That's trash that you, that, 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 that she wouldn't get something right there. So at it, you, you and I just, or all of us just witnessed that. This is all that came out of that ETB. That is absolute garbage. Yeah, that is, Shivam says that's super cold. Yeah, that is cold. I'm so sorry, guys. That sucks. That just sucks. That pisses me off a little bit. Sorry, I don't mean to get crazy. That really upsets me. That's just lame. I, I'll get you guys back on, on something else. I'm, I'm not even gonna, the the, the card the car, cards aren't even worth sending. There's nothing in there. All right. Should we open up a few more? Let's open up a few more packs. Let's go get. Let's go get a. Hold on. Let's go get a few more packs. This, that that's that's garbage. Hey, hang tight, guys. Hang tight. All right. So we're going to open up this guy right here. So another thing, guys, if you guys can get your hands on this, I'm predicting that this – that this, so I, I'm happy to open these up because Champion's Path has been, like, super rude to me anyway. But these Gengars are going to be worth something. I'm, tell, I'm telling you guys right now. So just something to, something to consider. So if you guys can get your hands on these, uh, keep this Gengar. I have a I have a weird like sneaky, like degenerate feeling that those are that they're going to be worth uh, money in a PSA ten later on, or just loose in general. Gengar's a, like a super popular Pokemon, so people like them. All right, five packs. So what we're gonna do rather than I'm just gonna pick someone out of the chat, and if it hit if there's so if there's something in there, I'm sending it to you. And that's all there is to it. Let me take this out without destroying it. No one cares about the Machamp. Let's see this guy. So this is the card, guys. Oh, this one's rip. Yeah, this one. I'm definitely sending this in. So I have a feeling that this that this promo Gengar is going to be worth some money. So I'm definitely sleeving this, and I'm sending that in. All right, here we go. So I'm just going to pick someone out of the chat. Let's see. Matt says, after your comment on the last live, I bought four of those Gengars to get greedy. I'm, 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 I'm telling you, Matt. I'm telling you. All right, here we go. Just gonna pick a random, a random human, and it is going to be Sitha with Y question mark. Sitha says Y. So Sitha, if you're still in here, I think you are. Yes, yeah, Sitha is. Sitha saying, let's go. Sitha says, let's go. All right, Sitha, this, this is for you. If there's something in here, I'm sending it to you. If not, then we're all going to be victims of Champion's Path. There's got to be something in these in these freaking boxes. I've opened up like like 20. Dang guys, what is going on? I'm so sorry, guys. I I want I want I want Champion's Path to hit, but it's just not hitting. It's just not hitting. That's that stinks. Sorry, Sitha. All right. Here we go. Let's go for another one. It's going to be. It is going to be Skywalker 31 with you're awesome is the comment. So Skywalker, are you still here? Uh, yeah, you are. It's a broke set. You're, you're, so Skywalker just said it's a broke set. You're not wrong. All right, Skywalker. This is all you, buddy. Let's get something. Let's get something. Even if it's an EX or a GX or whatever, I'm going to send it to you. But it has to be something better than just a freaking hollow. Because then it's just not worth the... I mean, come on. 
guys, someone someone has has hacked our packs, and you're you're seeing them. I'm pulling them right out of, and this is stuff bought right out of the store. There's no way that it can be like like uh, like weight or something, right? It's so brutal. I mean, well, how many packs? Have, we've opened twelve packs together with nothing. This has been the best thing that's come that, that's that's come out of all this. I mean, it's for real. Champions bust. Yeah, JB says champions bust. Okay, next one. Here we go. Mr. Mr. Cass says tonight is fire. Love the vibes. I couldn't agree with you more, dude. Derange says, uh, can you message me on Discord after the stream, please? Sure. Something is coming. I feel it. Something is coming. Put some comments in, guys. Let's go. Let's get somebody. I know Johnny Blaze says it's just not been your night. It's okay, man. Thank you, bro. I appreciate you, dude. JB's throwing in the fire. Tyler says, call the police, probably because I've been robbed. Right? All right, here we go, guys. Let's see who we get next. It is going to be Tyler Regan. The vault has been robbed. This is for you, Tyler. Here we go, buddy. Yeah, got to love Tyler. Tyler. Tyler's a homie. He just put good luck. All right, Tyler, this is all you, buddy. Let's get something for Tyler. Let's go. Pokeball. Something for Tyler. Something at a champion's path. Pokemon Company. Can you? Dude, I, you just, you, you can't, you can't, you can't make it up. Like if I, if I were smart, I would load the packs up with hits, but I'm just not that guy, you know? Sorry, Tyler. <laughs> Jerry says, why? <laughs> it's so bad. I know it's so bad. All right. Two more guys. Two more, two more. Some, there has to be something in here, right? I know Shivan says, no. Uh, Super says champions trash. Yeah. I, I, you're, you're not wrong. All right, here we go. Next. Two packs left. The next pack. Here we go. Next pack is going to. It's, it's scrolling. Braden Little. Braden Little says good luck. That was the comment. Is Braden still in here? Braden's got to be, right? Oh, Squirtle's in the house. What's up, Squirtle? Braden's here. Got to swing and hit a home run. All right, Braden, this is for you, buddy. All right, here we go. Something. Something. Something for Braden. Give him a freaking Charizard. Save the night. Save the night. No? Parva That's crazy. So crazy. See, you, Derange says you, you have to pull something. You'd think so, um, but I guess not. <laughs> JB says <laughs> rip. Yeah. That's it's an L for sure. All right, guys, last one, and I just can't dig into this anymore because I I'd have more, more fun lighting money on fire than opening the setup anymore. This set is absolute trash. All right, here we go. Last one. Put your comments in. I'll give it a second. <laughs> Sidna says Nintendo's up to some shady stuff. You're not wrong. There should be a hit if, if their ratio is every three. There should be a hit in here. Cut the pack up and then open it, says Matt. You're sick, Matt. You're sick. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Let's pick someone out of here. Ready? Here we go. It's scrolling and Matt Van Stratton with LPM. Did Matt get Matt? Did you get one already? I can't remember. Did you did you already hit? Let me know. Let me know if Matt Matt. Let me know if you did I pick. I can't remember, buddy. Did I did I pick your did you get picked for one already? Is Matt still in here? Hey Matt, did I pick you already? Just let me know if I picked you already, brother. I can't remember. No? Nope? Okay, cool. All right, Matt. This is for you, brother. Here we go. Let's get something for Matt. There's gotta be something in here. I have a terrible feeling that there's nothing in here. But I wanna like jinx it. Wouldn't it be and trash. So I'm so pissed right now. All right, that is. I'm so sorry, guys. That is that is a complete L. That's terrible. I, I, I'm I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, guys. All right, let's give this bad boy away indefinitely. No, no surprises here. Let's just give it away. That way, someone you know, someone gets something. 
All right, put your comments in. I'm going to read some comments and put your comments in, and then we'll, and then we'll do it. Yeah, Gustavo, terrible. Matt says, champs crush his souls. Yeah, you're not wrong. What's up, Spencer? Yeah, so the champion's path is just not the vibes, man. Super says, redeem yourself with Shining Fates. Champion. So this says, champion's path is not your path. Nick Burr says, go Kings. Yeah, go Kings. I am a Kings fan. I want to die because of that. <laughs> Don't do it, Deranged. It's not worth it, man. Nick says, go Kings. Yeah, I'm a big Kings fan. I am a big Kings fan. All right, guys. So let's give this bad boy away. All right, you ready? I'm gonna um, ten ten more seconds for the for the comments and then and then we'll pick someone. All right, here we go, guys. Break the Zard. Yeah, I should cut the Zard in half. Bobby Johnson says usually cat usually catch a live randomly, but love coming to hang out. Bobby, welcome, dude. Welcome. All right, here we go. Here goes the here goes the Zard. This is worth something, Lisa. I think these are worth like 15 or 20 bucks. So this is something. I, I thought we were going to pull something, but I didn't know we were just getting, I mean, we were going to get nothing out of 14 or 15 packs. We got nothing out of 15 packs. That's terrible. That, like shame on the Pokemon company. All right, here we go, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three. And it's going to Tyler Regan. Tyler, there you go, dude. Tyler with the good luck, everyone. See, that's what happens. When you throw in the good vibes on the on, on the chat, that's what happens. There you go, Tyler. This is all this is all yours, bro. Congratulations. I'm I'm happy for you. Hey, if you uh if you want to message me your your shipping info, I will ship this to you, my friend. So uh, my email is pokeball at yahoo.com. So email me your details, and this is going to you, my brother. Okay. Congrats, man. I'm gonna actually sleep put this in a sleep now. I'm just gonna put this in a in a card saver for you, just so it doesn't get like uh, like mutilated at all. And it's still in the plastic sleeve too. So there you go, Tyler. That's all yours, brother. And this is what. So this is a perfect example, guys. If I ever go live, sometimes I won't get do giveaways, but I'm never I'm never gonna announce it. And I want I want you guys to come because you want to be here, and and you might get something out of it. You know, Tyler got a Charizard tonight. That's what it's all about. Uh, I'm not leaving quite yet. I'm going to stay on for like another five to 10 minutes. Uh, but I did want to tell you guys something. So I don't really know. So some things that are, th some things that with the channel. Okay. I started working with, um, with a very cool dude who is doing my editing. So you're going to start to see better editing during the, during like the car, like the, the card pulling. I'm still going to do the intros because I think that's what makes us different than other channels. And I, and I want to continue to have control over that. But I partnered up with a guy who is doing this pretty much out of the kindness of his heart, guys. And so whenever you see uh, like Colton and his name's Colton, if I ever like shout him out, just know that that's the dude that's doing um, my editing. And then, you know, another guy that that should definitely receive some praise is Ryan Ridge, uh, aka Tony. Sorry, dude. I didn't mean to expose you. Uh, but Ryan is uh, is my mod for this, and he also, whenever he picks up a good deal, he a, a lot of the product that I open up for the channel has come from him, and he doesn't mark me up for it. He is one of the best dudes, and he's freaking hilarious. So that's another one. Uh, and then another one is you'll see deranged slime pop up all the time. He's our mod for the for the discord Give him some love too because he definitely holds it down um, And then the dude I can't remember the dude that helped me with the discord uh, He just did it out of the kind of he just like His name is oh, it's 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 sin sizzle. That's right or it's uh, something sizzle He made the discord for us guys. So that's another dude that is super wicked and I, I I can't say enough. So super says, what is a mod? So a mod super is someone who uh, moderates the chat. You know, if anyone's getting crazy, we don't have a lot of people and everyone that's in here just, just love, just loves to be here. So there's no issues there, but like big channels need mods to, 
to just keep everyone kind of contained, you know? Uh, let's see. Shivam says it's crazy how people react crazy when they see when they see giveaway in the thumbnail. Yeah. And that and that's why, Shivam, I just wanted to just do it for you guys. Do it for the fam, you know, for the people that want to be here. <laughs> Terrain says, praise me, you fools. Uh, that was a joke. I'm not power hungry. We all know Derange. We, your, your name is Derange Slime. You are definitely not uh, attention seeking or power seeking. We know that. Uh, Andrew says the Discord. So Discord, Andrew, is is this app. It's a Discord app. And it's just another place for people to get together, talk freely. Uh, a cool thing about a Discord is uh, they'll give you deals on things that are that are happening near you, like where you can buy stuff. If a website is selling stuff for cheap that you might be paying double for on eBay, they give you that info there. They talk everything Pokemon. Let's say you have a sick poll, you can you can post it there and just kind of like BS about polls. It's a great place to like to openly trade. It's kind of like an open market for trading and and discussing. So the Discord app is very cool. And then my. Uh, our Discord, the Pokevaults Discord, the link is in my latest uh, video's description. So go to my latest video, and it's in the description, and that'll invite you to the Discord, and you can join the Discord there. Yeah, Ryan says Discord. the Discord link is in the in the last video. Yeah, it is. Tyler says, love your stuff. Definitely not here for the giveaways, but I'm so grateful. Listen, I don't – don't – anyone who wins anything, I hope to one day – so, okay, let me, let, me, let me put it to you guys this way. The biggest growth on our channel has come from people sharing, sharing us on, um, like on their on their personal. So one place where we got a couple hundred subs is from Limwood. So he's a dude that that's just a guy that I that I that I met through the channel, and he's been sharing my channel through his Reddit, through his Facebook, through his Instagram. He's brought so many people to me. People have said I'm here because of Limwood Slip. And that blows my mind. I do the giveaways on the off chance that someone might say, hey, let me throw the Pokeball into my Reddit or into my Facebook and tell some of my people that I, all I can do is try to get some free publicity. So that's, that's why I do it. And I do it because I care about you guys. I hope one day that I can get big enough. Like if I got on Leon's level one day, let's say I got a million subscribers one day. Number one, I would never forget you guys. Number two, I would be giving away stuff that would blow your effing minds. I would, I would be giving away thousands and thousands of dollars. Like I would, I would, I would do like a giveaway where I'd have five people come to. I have this idea, like where I have a booster box. Let's say I have a base set booster box worth thirty thousand dollars. The last person to take their hand off of it wins. Like I want to do some like Mr. Beast crap, but with Pokemon. Imagine that. Or like I don't I don't know I, I it's a, maybe that's a dumb idea but stuff like that I want to do like crazy big giveaways and stuff like that that would be really cool. Uh, let's see, Debo D, or Debio says uh, I'm not here for the giveaways either. I don't have many friends that like Pokemon. Well, you Deb, you have a lot of friends here that like Pokemon and that they like you. Super says I want to meet you so bad. I am. I'm just like I am, but I probably look worse in real life, like more pale, because I think the camera actually adds color to my my pasty ass. Um, let's see. Mookie says one million is possible. It seems like a long way away. It's hard to even get to three thousand. <laughs> Ryan says, "Give away a smart car with a poker with a poker wrap." <laughs> you are you are you are messed up, dude. But I like you. Uh, Durant says it's the coolest idea ever. Uh, Super said I, I really want to meet you in real life more than a more than a YouTuber. I appreciate that, Super. Shivam says once you once you hit 10k, we ball in big, big. Yeah, if 10,000 is gonna be, I'm gonna open something stupid, I, like where it doesn't make it doesn't make financial sense, and I'm gonna open something out of the out of the vault. Andrew says you're in LA. Mookie, uh, work deep pocket monsters about the giveaway. He knows about that stuff a lot, yeah. Yeah, Deep Pocket Monsters is cool. Uh, Tariq says, that reminds me of that one episode from, from Smart Guy, yeah. Durain says, are you going to be at Leon's event? Um, probably. Yeah, Tyler says, no more Smart Cars. Yeah, I'm, uh, depending on how, on how it goes, uh, I'm working it out with him now. I just bought, so I, I just... Uh, so in case you, I mean, you guys know, but I, I've been friends with Leon for a long time. 
uh, we do we have a we have an agreement together for the, some of the cards that he pulls. He keeps the ones that he wants, and then whatever he doesn't want to sell, he used to throw them in a drawer, and I, I buy them off of him. I just bought like like fifty cards off of him for a couple for not I mean not a lot, but he uh, and it wasn't just recent; it was like a couple of weeks ago. But I'm just getting them now. Uh, but I'll show you guys those. Those are pretty cool. It, it's kind of it's kind of it sucks because like I'm I'm Pokemon rich, but I'm cash poor in the sense that like. I just spend too much money on Pokemon stuff. You know, it's just it's just not even correct. Uh, let's see. Is anyone going to Collecticon? What's what's Collecticon? Is that a, is that a thing that I should know about? Uh, Durange says, "Do you know where the event will be located? It will be located in Texas." Mr. Cast says, "Good night." Yeah. On that note, um, I am probably going to end it. Uh, Tyler, send me your info. Uh, thank you guys so much for being here. It seems weird that 30 people would want to be with me on a, on a Tuesday night, but yeah, I appreciate you guys. Uh, I care about you and I'll see you on the next comment of the next episode. Cause I know you guys will be there. All right. Have a good night guys. Later.